panic buying or something. Oh, uh, no. Just you know, paranoid still. And flying to New Zealand. <laughs> There's so much stuff to take. Uh, you know, they're spiders as big as your face and bugs that bite you on the loo. On the loo? I read it somewhere. I was thinking, when you're back, we could maybe go for a drink or something. Just because Uncle Max told me that you two were together, so I thought, we're basically family now. <laughs> You've seen that one coming, eh? <clears throat> no, I just meant because we thought you and Mick were going to last. Well, that's life, innit? I, mean, I think you've got it all mapped out before you're even 20, and then stuff happens and your fairy tale and it disappears. I don't know. I, I think me and Keek are going to be OK. That's what I thought when I was your age, but trust me, you've no idea how hard it gets, all right? No idea. Well, yeah, we're young, but I love him. Too much to let anything happen to us. Maybe you're one of the lucky ones. Yeah, I hope so. You all right? Oh, well, yeah, I mean, I haven't finished packing. And, and Mick's gone AWOL. I mean, if you don't get to say goodbye to Wally... It's OK. You know, I've made my fair share of life-changing decisions, but this is a big one. But it's very quick, Linda. I'm good. I'm good. OK. Bye. Take care.